about how it is that Rick and I found one another or how we met. Uh, the thing is that um, I, I, I wasn't looking um, so that there really wasn't, isn't that I found him as much as it is that God placed him in my path. The first time that I met Ella, I was actually going into Oak Crest to deliver an offer and I went to the receptionist uh, area and there she was. When I'm asked where did we meet, you know, I, I say that I met him at the cross because one of the more profound views from my reception desk is a very strong um, structural uh, beam that looks like a cross there at the door and he just appeared and we were introduced and um, he said he knew me. As I went into Oak Crest because I had an offer to deliver, and I went up to the receptionist area, and there was a young lady there, and her name was Ella Honesty, and I remember Ella from the past, and I was uh, surprised to see that she was back in town. One of my favorite uh, Bible verses is Jeremiah 29, 11, which speaks to the fact that God will send you um, out into the nations and call you back to um, your original homeland, and that he has plans for you, plans for us all to prosper us and give us a, a hope for the future. And so that's the way I feel about what's happened with um, our coming together. It was truly part of God's plan. But the second time I ran across her was at uh, Stylist Seconds, where, and that's a shop that a friend of mine and his wife runs. And it was a surprise to me that she was in there. And so, with a quickness and a knowing, um, we spent time talking to one another and realizing how God had put in motion people in our, pivotal people in our lives. I was actually here at this park at the reception of uh, Sherry Beachy's and, um, and she said something to me that was pretty profound. She says that you like to cha-cha, don't you? And I said, what do you mean by that? She says that you like to take three steps up and then take three steps back. And I said, is that what I'm actually doing? She says that you have a lot of fear and reservations about your future. And I see a bright and, and uh, awesome future uh, for you and, and even for us. Probably one of the most profound moments that I, I love was the day that um, he actually chose to propose. And um, I knew probably something was up. And he asked that I meet him at um, a restaurant where we first went to dinner. I asked her uh, to meet me at this uh, particular restaurant uh, later on that evening and she met me and, and the maitre d' uh, taking us to our station where I had it beautifully decorated. Uh, with um, all the things that I knew that she, she loved. To walk into a space where I could see that, my gosh, this guy went all out <laughs> to make it a special occasion from balloons to roses that look like, you know, tree toppers at Christmas time to, I mean, it was like very overwhelming. Uh, but it showed his creative side and, and it really did my heart good to see that, you know, we have those things in common. And uh, she was pleasantly surprised, and um, it was at that time I uh, gave her an engagement ring and asked her uh, would she be my wife, and happily and joyfully, uh, she said yes. So, honey, I just want you to yeah. know that I think it was a great idea mm -hmm. um, that you had to come up with 
doing a video mm -hmm. and uh, telling about how we met each other and our pathway to love. And, and for me, it gives me an opportunity to um, thank those that made um, coming home a joy. No, I, I really just want to uh, say that uh, God, we're born with a family and then God uh, gives us an extended family in, in, in the guise of, of angels that he puts around us to help us and guide us and prune us and, and just make us strong. And uh, We just want to take this time to thank uh, the, the countless number of people that helped us um, during this uh, last several months. Uh, the, uh, people that um, were near and, and dear to our lives. We want to thank you for coming and, and sharing this, um, this time with us. Uh, you are near and dear to us, and we just want to say that we love you, and we ask God to, to bless you and smile upon you, and that uh, may the joy that you see permeating from us reignite the love that is inside of you. We thank you and we bless you.